Hi. In this video, I would like to explain a tricky concept in a simple way. There is a mass m1, a blue box, which comes in at a constant velocity and collides against a spring and block system on the right hand side. The green spring is connected rigidly to the brown box. So as the blue box comes in and hits the spring, its kinetic energy gets transferred to the spring and block system which then does certain things. So here is the animation for that. The blue box comes in at a velocity, the spring gets compressed and finally it expands and the brown box moves away. To understand what's happening here, the blue box which came in at a velocity v1 and a kinetic energy half m1 v1 whole squared hit that green spring. The spring pushed back on it so its kinetic energy reduces the blue box decelerates. Part of that loss in kinetic energy is transferred to the spring as well as the brown box. And that's why the brown box also gets kinetic energy and starts moving away. Now at the point of maximum compression, we have to understand what really is happening here. If the left extreme end of that green spring is moving towards the right extreme end of that green spring, it means that the spring is getting compressed. On the other hand, if the right extreme end of the spring is moving away from the left extreme end of the spring, it means that the spring is expanding. So, the physical and mathematical condition for maximum compression of the spring in this case is that there should not be any relative velocity or relative motion between the left extreme end and the right extreme end of that spring. Looking at it another way, it means that the mass m1 and the mass m2 should be moving with a constant velocity. There should be no relative velocity between them. And that gives us the concept of a common velocity after collision. Therefore, it's possible to work with the kinetic energy equations and the law of conservation of momentum. Now in this final stage, the blue box is decelerated a lot and the energy transferred to the brown box makes it accelerate and it moves away and that causes the expansion of the spring. I hope this video was clear. Thanks and have a great day.